I chose to come here to Isia Sapero to experience uh, what Europe has to offer and try and find a lot more work opportunities in the aerospace field. I chose to do the Advanced Aerodynamics and Propulsion major. The most exciting subjects that we got to do as part of this was the Experimental Fluid Mechanics subject where we coupled it with our CFD course and we were able to run some wind tunnel tests and actually test out physical phenomena in experiments and then use that data to validate our CFD uh, simulations. And I thought that was a really cool, uh, very practical experience that we got to gain here at Supero. My research project is on the Mars 2020 rover, uh, the SuperCam device, which is like the head of the rover, and how the flow of the Martian air affects the measurements a microphone on it takes. And so I've been doing a lot of CFD simulations with that, and I've found it very fascinating to be able to work on uh, simulations of the Mars 2020 rover. So as a part of the university clubs, I've participated in uh, a few sporting clubs, particularly the Ultimate Frisbee Club and the Badminton Club, as well as tried out a few other ones. And I found it's very welcoming and very easy to go and participate in these new clubs and try out new things. And it's a great way to meet other students, particularly the French students that uh, in the masters we don't have classes with. So it's a great way to meet other people and practice your French. I'm not entirely sure what I want to do after graduating uh, because there's so many opportunities that are now uh, available to me in Europe. In particular, this Masters has opened so many doors to uh, different internships and job possibilities in France and abroad that I hadn't really considered before. So I'm not sure what the Masters uh, will lead me to next, but I know that there's so many things to choose from and I'm excited to see what I will be able to do in the future. So the scholarships I received from Australia are from the South Australian Space Industry Centre and the Sir Ross and Sir Keith Smith Fund. So both of these uh, organisations provide funds to uh, support students in their furthering uh, their education and I was fortunate enough to be granted both scholarships. <laughs>